Chris Avea, job done. How'd you feel? I felt good. You know, uh, it is what it is. You know, uh, I'm ready to fight any time of the night. We can. We could have fought at 1 a.m. I would have still did my thing. The fight week in general has been quite active. There's been a lot of action, but you guys have stayed calm and stayed effective in business. How did it feel when you got in the ring with him, Jake, as an opponent? Uh, I felt like I always feel uh, I wasn't paying any attention to what he was bringing. I knew what I had to do, and I, I have I have more I have more experience in him, and uh, I know I get the job done. I knew what I can do, and I did it. And uh, yeah, I would have looked a little better and got the. I would have looked for a finish. I would have rather gotten a finish, or I don't care. It's all good. No, I, I got the win. I didn't. I plan. I didn't think I lost a round. I don't know why they gave him a round though. I'm, I'm pretty irritated about that, but it is what it is. It's all good. Whenever the the announcer sort of indicates a split decision's coming, I always try and keep a look at the fighters' faces. And as soon as one round was given to Jake, I saw you look surprised and a disapproving look, should I say? What went through your mind when you heard Jake being given one of the cards? I was just like, dude, not another. I wasn't surprised if they fucking gave, did like some stupid shit and gave him like a win or something. I was like, bro, I obviously won the fight four, four to nothing. And then they give him a round, and uh, obviously I was like surprised, and I was like, dude, another fucking, another stupid fucking, uh, another stupid fucking event or this whatever. I was irritated, surprising that they gave him a round, but oh okay, god, I, I, he didn't even hit me. So how how are you gonna how are you gonna give him a, a round when he ain't even landed a, a single punch? It's like, bro, I saw I saw you enjoying yourself in the ring when you landed a couple times. You'd smile, nod at him. Did you feel in control throughout? Yeah, it was way too easy, man. It's like a sparring match. I should have knocked him out, though, but it's all good. Is there a sign of frustration that you didn't? Uh, I don't care. It was only four rounds. I'd rather, I, I'd like to do like eight rounds. But uh, I just wanted to get some rounds in because I have a fight coming up in June. So I need a little, little warm up. So yeah. Was... Do we see you back on Misfits? I said it last time, no, and then it happened again tonight, but so uh, I plan on not fucking around with Misfits, but uh, if there's some, if they want to pay me some money and give me a, a worthy opponent, then yeah. Sounds like a will see. There's one fighter in particular, Idris Virgo, who's been calling your name a lot. Is that a fight that interests you? I don't even know who that is. Uh, so no, I know who... I know of KSI, I know this is his shit. I'll fight him, but all these little YouTubers and whatever, all these guys are fucking, they, they don't want to see a real fighter. What I did to Jake, like, bro, that was easy. I'll fucking beat the fuck out of anybody in this whole roster. Facts. Chris, congratulations on your victory tonight. Well done. Thank you, I appreciate it. Welcome, Chris.